What's going on everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. Folks, I'm able to get one to two videos out. We're going to see what happens. Depends on the scheduling of the new job. So just stick with me on this and bear with me on this. We're going to get some of these videos out for you because I do have a ton of them to get out. All right, folks, we're going to have a look at Sol 1647. It's a gigapan from Joe from Art Alien TV. Thank you, Joe, for doing this. And I'm going to show everybody this gigapan and where they can get it. Folks, let's not waste any time. Let's just jump right into this. All right, you can see it right here. At the top of the screen is MSL, Sol 1647 ML. And you can see, of course, credit goes to Art Alien TV. Again, Joe, thank you for your uh, work on this. And you can see the images by NASA, JPL, Caltech, and MSSS. Now, you can see it's 155.2 by 12.8 in at 300 DPI. So anyway, like I said, let's just jump right into this. I want to show you something that's really interesting if we zoom all the way into this, just real quick. I don't think for a moment that this is natural. Look at the curvature of this on both left and right. Now you can see on the left hand side it's kind of tilted into the ground a little bit more. Another thing you'll notice is look at the blurring like it's supposed to be sand and then you can see just a little bit of detail just above all that blurring. See that? See how they did that? That to me though right there off the bat is not natural. Now I'm going to jump way over here. Folks I'm more interested in this area right here. We've been seeing this area for quite a while. I'm going to show you that right off the bat, there's a few things you can look at that are clearly not natural. Okay. Now this right off the bat tells me these so-called hills look like they have corners. Them. See the straight lines it appears to have a corner right there. Straight lines right here. Now question is how far is this away? Well, I don't think it's as far as people think it is. I believe that these are structures and other intelligently made objects. When you go over here, just look at some of the shapes of some of these things. And by the way, I believe this line right here going across is supposed to be a part of the layering of this hill or whatever it may be. I don't believe that's the case. They want you to believe that these are mountains so that they're real far away, right? Again, I don't believe that at all. Go over here. Again, see this gray line right there? I don't believe that's real at all. I believe that's a fudge line. And I believe whatever this is goes down in this section. Okay. All right. So let me show you a couple things. Like I said, I showed you this area. It appears to be like a really large structure. And you can see the straight lines. It will look like a corner. Even back here. See this? All right. Here. This one's interesting. Okay. Let's have a look, first of all, right here. This one doesn't look very clear, but check this out. It looks like some kind of weird hooded area. And you'll see it looks like a structure inside what looks like rectangular black areas. And you can see it just faintly there and one right there. Here is the same way. They kind of blotch it up, but you'll see one, two, and three rectangular areas. We got something right here. Picture a flat rectangular block, but much, much larger. And it's buried like 80% of the ground and just the end of it sticking out. You're seeing the side as well as maybe a piece of the top. And you'll see what I mean when we get into that a little further as well. Here, what's up with this? It looks like we have some kind of archway right there. I'll put it right smack dab in the middle of the screen. It looks like some kind of archway or some kind of contour to something much larger. Is it possible that this is some kind of cave or some kind of opening to something that's in the ground or in the side of these so-called mountains? Hmm. Let's just jump right into Photoshop and take a better look, shall we? All right, here's the whole photo right there. Now, folks, all I did was do a quick equalization, and this is what I come up with. You can see right here, it's lighter on the left, a little darker on the right, right? Okay, so let's jump right into this. Starting to see the shapes here, folks? Check this out. I, again, I don't believe that this line is real at all. I think they're just trying to divide it to try to mess with your eyes a little bit, right? Okay. You can start to see this a little bit better now. This object, or objects. This one right here, I said that was buried in the ground. This, what looks like this cave opening, 
or arched structure of some sort right there. You'll see something right here sticking out. And I'm going to do like an outline of this so you guys can see this, what I'm looking at, what I'm seeing. Again, this right here. I don't believe for a moment that that's natural. I believe those are multiple level structures. It's like a giant building. You can literally see what looks like corners right here. You've got your straight lines. And of course you look and it does this. Okay. Like this and then back down. You can see what looks like something doing this. Like there's multiple floors of this complex or whatever it may be. Notice the different shapes in here. Little ones down here. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to back out. I'm going to let you guys see the overall, and then we're going to zoom in from left to right. Okay? Now, a lot of it I made brighter so you can see it better. But let's just do that real quick. So here's from left to right. I'm just going to go slowly across this. Again, we have this arched piece. We'll go in a little further. Right there, see something coming out like this here. Okay, move it along to the right. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you just this area alone. Instead of the full enhance, I wanna show you this area again. I'm gonna outline that. What is this right here, folks? Look at this. What? Look at that. All we got to do, just bring up the lines, folks. Just the lines. See it? Made the whiter parts brighter here. But check that out. All you can get is bits and pieces out of here, again, because it's completely lacking in detail. Not a whole lot of details at all. Some areas have a lot of detail. And you can see what looks like squares, different weird looking pipes, 90 degree corners and things. Uh, so again, we're like reading between the lines, so to speak, and bringing out some of the lines. And we're able to bring out some of the stuff that makes sense, some of it, not so much. And you can see that. This area down here, check that out. Again, it looks like this weird opening, because we do have this other white line, so that kind of messes things up. But still, you can see that. It still ends right there, pretty much. And let's say this side is false, and it does not end there. Okay, we still have this right here. Kind of looks like it's got a slight bow to it. Does this. Okay. We have this right here. If you look at this piece, we have like a line we're able to bring out of that. See it? It is there. It is, in fact, there in the photo. You can see it right there. This right here, you can see it. Okay. All right. I'm going to show you this right here in the middle where I really wanted to concentrate on and show you this because this is cool. All right, so here it is. Again, folks, look at this. We have this up here. Look at the odd shapes that are in it as well. Okay, we have this right here running like this. Okay, I'm not sure that's natural. Let me show you the outline of this. Check this out. Look at the lines, study the lines, especially in this structure down here on the right, or right here at the right, depending on how you want to look at it. Okay? Look at the lines, and then I'm going to outline it. This, like I said, appears to have almost like this weird shaped, like opening structure type thing. You have these openings or windows of some sort, not sure. And look inside, this thing's doing, looks like this here. You can see what looks like a darker square and just maybe half to three quarters of another. You don't see the whole thing. But to me, see it? All we did was just bring it out better. See it? You can see it still right there. And that's before doing anything to this thing. Because like I said, all I do is an equalization, nothing more. Didn't use the burn tool, didn't use a thing. Okay, and we can see these objects. Even these here, they do not look natural at all. You can see that. 
look right here. This is cool. Almost like there's like these little squares. Almost like window type things. This thing's coming down like this. You can see the lines going up like this here. Again, I believe this is a fake line. I don't believe that's real at all. But check that out. It looks like structures as opposed to natural rock and hills. Again, folks, check that out. Just this alone. Just that alone. The way they look designed. Again, design. And, of course, these. These right here. That's all we need to see. To me, that shows intelligence. Absolute intelligence. As usual, folks, I want to let you decide. And there you go. Folks, as always, I look at these hills, and I don't see hills at all. I see disguised structures. I see what looks like mechanical parts. I see some things that look like completely intact, and I see some things maybe not so much. What do you folks see? As always, folks, drop your comments down below. Let me know what you think, and let me know what you see. Leave a timestamp. Maybe you've seen something different I didn't see. Just let me know. Please like and share the video. It's always appreciated. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up so that YouTube shares it. Folks, I do have more coming up. Again, I'm tweaking out my work hours, so we are going to try to get at least a couple made during the week. Stay tuned for that. Anyway, folks, have yourself a good one. Peace. We'll see you soon.